What's in the box? My name is Derek and I do YouTube videos about audio equipment. If you guys enjoy that type of stuff, you might enjoy subscribing to my channel and I'd appreciate it. I was contacted by Massive Audio a few months ago asking if I wanted to try out their new line of subwoofers, this BOA-121. I was like, you know what? I could use a high powered subwoofer here in the lab, but this thing is a freaking backbreaker. Let's look into it and see what it's all about. The one I received is the BOA-121. It's a dual one ohm mega subwoofer is what they call it. 12 inches in diameter. The retail price on their website is $1,199. You can get a discount right there on the website if you check the link there. We'll check the specs here. I'll let you guys read it. Basically, it has a fat cast basket. It has a fat foam surround. It has dual 4-inch 1-ohm voice coils. And it has a triple stacked 470-ounce strontium magnets. So yes, this Joker weighs about 75 pounds. She is heavy duty. And 6,000 watts RMS, 12,000 watts peak. 21 gigawatts. Here I show a comparison to the JL Audio 12W6V2. And you can see this massive sub is just monstrous compared to that sub. And that's not a small subwoofer. And here is the side view. Again, the magnets are just, give it some booty. Now, this is a dual one ohm voice coil. On this website, the12volt.com, they have a real good diagram here that shows you how to wire it up. We're gonna wire it at two ohms, wired in series. And I'll show you how we do that here. We take the positive from one voice coil and the negative from the other and wire those together. And then we just use the negative on one voice coil and the positive on the other. And you can see here, we'll test it out right around two ohms, 1.9 ohms. Now we'll get the Rockford Fosgate T2500.1 BDCP wired up, hooked up to this massive audio subwoofer so we can try out some demos for you guys. Let's fire it up. All right, friends, here we have the massive audio BOA-121 6,000 watt RMS subwoofer that's rated 12,000 watts peak. As you guys saw how I wired it up, I wired it up in series. So I went positive on one coil to negative on the other, and then I'm using the positive and negatives on each of the opposite coils. Gives us two ohms, this is a dual one. We're going into the Rockford T2500 BDCP, and let's go ahead and power this up so we can see what it looks like when we turn it on. Oh yes, output meter, voltage meter, the voltage is into the yellow because the voltage is a little high. You can see 15.36, uh, but it'll be good. So let's crank it up, see how it does. So after breaking in the sub for a little bit free air, I decided it's time to put it in a box so I can show you guys some more potential of it. I ordered this SPL box a while back. It has a one inch solid uh, front baffle, but as you can see, the sub don't fit. You big dummy. So here's the subwoofer box. And unfortunately, the dimensions they gave me were not quite right because it said uh, it's about 10 and a half inches deep, I think. And this is about like 10.2 inches deep. But when I tried to put it in the box, yeah, it didn't quite fit. So we're going to try to invert. Hopefully I'm going to measure, you know, from here to here and make sure that the opening is big enough so we don't squish the uh, surround. But I'm going to try to mount it inverted and not break my back so we can listen to this. And it's, uh, it's about a three cubic foot box and that's the small end of the ported enclosure for this sub. So let's try it out. Looks like the foam is 10 and three quarters and the opening is a little over 11, so it should be fine.
before we get to the inbox demo, make sure you check out 12 volt talk, youtube.com slash 12 e talk. We're also available on podcast only Apple podcasts, Spotify, and more. Check us out. We have guests all the time. It's lots of fun. Yep, it's pretty uh, understated that I'm going to have to do some sound treatment here in my lab. The garage door <laughs> shaking like crazy. I'm sure the neighbors all the way down the road can hear this sub. It just sounds absolutely killer with this Rockford T2500. It is thumping. I wish there was a better way I could show you guys. Kind of give you an idea of how loud it is, but it's just, yeah. All right, guys, so there you can see the massive, massive audio BOA-121. Just incredible. I can't really display everything it can do because it would make everything in my lab here fall off the walls. I don't have any vehicles capable of the SPL this will put out, so I'm going to just not show that part, but it's an incredible incredible sub took all the power that t2500 could put out plus i know it could probably do two of them strapped hmm maybe we'll try that sometime in the future what you think thumbs up till next time you know where i'm at big thanks to massive audio for sending this subwoofer this was not a paid ad this was more like just a here big d use this and tell us what you think Special thanks, Jay, Matthew, Marcus, Jesus Tire, Soundstream Registry. I'm out of here. Make sure to check out some of my other videos on my channel. I have over 500 videos here on YouTube, most of them car audio related. Some home audio, some pro audio, some big dummy related. But anyway, just check them out if you get a chance. Thanks for watching.